Hi everyone, it's Caitlin again. Now that we've collected data for our mulch experiment, it's time for the moment you have all been waiting for. Analyzing our data to find out which mulch type decomposed the fastest, and which mulch type decomposition rates were fastest, and where the moisture in the soil was the highest. So as you have seen now, it's not enough for us to just collect data on one bag of mulch or in one area of the soil. So to make sure we can trust our numbers, we measured the mass of 20 bags of each mulch type, 20 bags of woody mulch and 20 bags of straw-like mulch. We also used those soil moisture meters that we built and coded to take three different soil moisture measurements in each of our 10 plots, which included three treatments, woody mulch, straw-like mulch, and no mulch. Today, we'll be thinking about how we can take all of that data and display it visually so that we can figure out if there are differences between the different treatments. We wanna know which of our mulch treatments worked the best. You'll also look back at your original hypothesis and the original model that you created showing your ideas about decomposition and mulch in Morro Canyon in order to see if your findings match your initial ideas. Your first task today will be to create graphs that will help us compare the decomposition rates and soil moisture in our different mulch treatments. Woody mulch, straw-like mulch, and no mulch. Go ahead and move on to the next slide to get started.